Do you think that you are not attractive? Do you think that no one will ever see you as a potential partner? Are there things that could make a person less attractive? You might be surprised about these facts that I am going to tell you right now. There are psychological things that could make you less attractive, and we are going to talk about that in this video. Hi, welcome to Soul Joy Arena, and in this channel, we talk about relationships, marriages, love, sex, and much more. The psychology of attraction has long been a fascinating subject, and researchers have put a lot of effort into determining what makes certain people more attractive than others. Numerous aspects influence attraction, and while we'd like to think that we pick our romantic partners carefully, research reveals that some external factors matter considerably more than others. You might accidentally be given off a vibe that makes you seem less appealing if you're finding it difficult to meet people or if you keep failing to get a date. There are particular actions that anyone may take to improve their attractiveness, but there are also things that can work against you. Additionally, a lot of this self-sabotage occurs subconsciously so you can send out the wrong signals without even realizing it. Here are the psychological factors that make you less attractive. Number 1. Being too clingy Now, this does not mean that you should become too attached just because other people find you more appealing when you are familiar. Insecurity results from being needy and clingy, which is undesirable. In fact, studies in the field of psychology have identified it as the top relationship turnoff. This behavior repels others in an almost instinctive way. Don't misunderstand me. It's not necessarily wrong to want a relationship. You'll end up rejecting the one person you want to connect with, though, when your desire for connection transforms into a need. Being too needy repels a person, and it lessens their interest. Number 2. Being a flirt to anyone some people enjoy flirting with everyone. Even though fun encounters aren't necessarily bad, this tendency may make you less desirable to the one particular person you really want to make a move on. There's a narrow line between being flirty and being overly friendly, and your actions will eventually come across as fake. It may sometimes be challenging to express your sincere affection to someone. They might think you act that way with everyone, even though you might be making love gestures toward them. You must project a more refined sense of taste if you want to come across as more attractive. Instead of flirting with everyone, focus more on the person you really like. Number 3. Poor Grammar Yes, that is accurate. A poor command of the English language or even the language you're using to pursue a potential mate can turn off a romantic interest, especially if you participate in online dating. According to a study, the majority of men and women stated that they only reject online daters who have poor grammar and misspelled words in their dating profiles. What specifically about poor grammar scares away people? It appears that, in addition to demonstrating a lack of education, poor grammar, careless spelling, and a lack of punctuation also indicate a lack of interest. After all, are you truly committed to having an adult relationship if you can't even put a period at the end of your Tinder or dating profile sentences? If you want to impress, brush up on basic grammar before you start swiping right. What do you think about these points so far? Please share them in the comments section below. And hey, if you are still new to our channel and love our topics, please consider subscribing so that you will be notified anytime we upload a new video. Also, give it a thumbs up as this will allow YouTube to show this video to more people. Thanks! And now, let's continue. Number 4. Being Arrogant Confidence is appealing, all things considered. It's very endearing to be around someone who doesn't have to question anything that say they say or do since they feel confident on their own skin. 
The sweet spot for confidence, like every other quality, is somewhere in the middle of the spectrum. Equally unattractive is being too insecure might be. Being overconfident can be a complete turnoff, particularly when you consider that flaws do not favor anyone in particular. Although having a self-assured attitude might be charming, avoid becoming arrogant and self-centered in the process. Number 5. Being lazy and lacks purpose. For people who sincerely care about themselves, healthy behaviors should come effortlessly. Proper nutrition, skin care, exercise, reading, etc. But some people will not carry out simple actions that they are aware are healthy. Knowing that your laziness affects everything about you, including how others see you, is important if you have absolutely no motivation or desire to do anything positive for yourself. It seems that people don't really like those who are lazy and lack motivation. A liability to themselves and those around them is someone who lacks ambition, drive, or goals. No one expects you to be perfect when they first meet you, of course, but they do want you to work towards something. Number 6. Bad odor or smelling similar Numerous studies have demonstrated the importance of smell in social interactions, especially romantic ones. Since it is tightly linked to health and cleanliness, how you smell has a direct impact on how other people view you. Foul odor lowers your potential mate rating since it makes you more prone to parasites and diseases. But there are other, less visible ways that fragrance might affect attractiveness. Researchers and scientists have found that humans find persons who smell similar to us less attractive. And the reason for it is that it's in our evolutionary best interest to avoid mating with people from the same genetic lineage. Number 7. Obsessive with looks You won't be as appealing as you could if you're overly obsessed about your appearance. There is nothing wrong with wanting to seem presentable and appropriate for the situation, of course. It makes it easier to prevent unfair judgments against you. However, if you put too much importance on your appearance, you could start to rely more on appearances than on real qualities. Additionally, it quickly grows boring to be with someone who continually examines themselves in front of every mirror to ensure every hair is in its proper place. It's awkward to be with someone who constantly looks at their face and thinks that they are too attractive. If you can relate to any of the items on the list, it might be time to reflect on your own actions and thoughts. We frequently associate attraction with physical attractiveness. Being attractive, however, involves more than just having a good appearance. True attraction involves being drawn to someone's full essence, flaws, and all. What do you think about this topic? Do you agree with us too? What other things could make someone less attractive? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.